Well, hello everybody. Adam and Kristen coming to you here from the Ganachery at Disney Springs. Kristen, why are we here? The Ganachery has amazing chocolatey treats. And today we are here specifically for the Olaf. Christmas time Olaf hot chocolate hot cocoa, I guess you could say. Oh my gosh, so I called yesterday to see if they had it and they said they were out and that the best thing to do is to come close to opening, which is at 10 a.m., uh, to see if they still had some left. So it's Olaf and he's a chocolate Olaf with cocoa? A cocoa bomb. Inside, a cocoa bomb. So uh, <laughs> do you want to go inside, see if they've got it? I'm hoping, fingers crossed. All right, let's do it. This is it? Yeah. Oh, they've got plenty, huh? Yeah. Look at that. Olaf Coco Surprise, so it's limit two per guest. Yes. Um, these are really fantastic. Remember, these are the Santa Mickey Pinatas. Dark chocolate spear filled with marshmallow treats. Now, we got one of these for Halloween, uh, and it was fantastic. I really enjoyed it. So I, I'm going to pass on this today, but... But I'm so excited. They have a ton of the Olafs. We definitely came for this. Yes. All right. Should we grab two since there are two of us? Sure. All right. That way the kids can have one too, right? Sure. Yeah. Okay. Um, how much is it? It does not say. It does not say. I'm just excited that they've got it. Yeah. All right. Well, let's run with it. Oh, there you go. $28. <laughs> I think we're going to get one. I think one is just enough. Twenty-eight dollars. So well, this is the Santa Pinata, but yeah. it's probably the same price. Okay. All right. Just this Olaf, please. What did she just buy? What is this? It's a toffee crunch. I opened the bag over there. On that a toffee crunch. How it's much is it? It's eleven dollars. Can we try one? I, I would love. Oh, I mean, can we? Oh, can I get one? Yeah. <laughs> For sure. Thank you. Oh, I think my wife would really like that. Okay. Oh, I am so pumped, Kristen. We got it. We got it. I was worried that they were going to be sold out, but we got it. <laughs> well, clearly um, they have that issue because they even have signs know, uh, to limit. return back the next day after they make some more. So these are hot item. Usually they're uh, seasonal items. Uh, do go very quickly. So if there's something that you want, try to get and plan your morning to come when they first open. Uh, like I said, some of the Halloween stuff was always uh, flying off the shelves. And clearly the Olaf hot cocoa surprise is a big ticket. It was packed in there. Now, because Olaf was a little bit cheaper than we thought, he wasn't $28. It was 17. It was 17. So I got us something a little extra. I got you some um, dark coffee crunch okay. that we can try too. So now let's head home. And some things I hear are worth melting for. So I think we're gonna melt down Olaf and uh, we're gonna check out this uh, hot cocoa um, bomb at home. Do you wanna go try it out? I'm all ready. All right, let's do it. Oh, look, even baby Harpy came with us to the Springs. <laughs> I love your new shirt. Thank you. Baby Harper, do you like new. Olaf? She's a big Olaf fan. I think she is. She loves Olaf. And Frozen. I think Frozen's gonna be her favorite movie, don't I you think? I think so too. Yeah, I think Frozen's gonna be her favorite. We'll see. All right, we made it home. Olaf is ready to melt, right, Kristen? Yes. <laughs> I'm all ready to try this amazing <laughs> Olaf hot cocoa surprise. Is Do you what wanna they take him out? Sure. Grab him. Okay. He's actually pretty big. Yeah, it's so, so much bigger. Did it bigger. say how much it's it serves? It's yeah, it's two. So it's so much bigger than I thought it would be. Look, he's huge. Yeah, that's the awesome. Size of my hand. Wow, and it also comes with what else is in there? There's uh, looks like there's some marshmallows in oh, there. We don't want. Oh them yeah, we don't there. want them to melt yet. <laughs> yeah. Oh wow, yeah, I think there's marshmallows in there. So mm -hmm. he is, he's hollow, and inside he's got cocoa. That's right. So the concept is he melts down the chocolate and inside is hot chocolates that will go into uh, making your hot cocoa here at home. So right here on the package, it says 
from the Ganachery. It says it makes two cups, and for the recommended prep, it says you should heat one cup whole milk and one cup heavy cream together in a medium saucepan over medium-low heat until a low simmer and then remove from heat. And then using large tongs, carefully and gently place uh, chocolate Olaf into the saucepan. Uh, so once he starts to melt, uh, whisk together until the chocolate is fully incorporated. And then pour evenly into two mugs and garnish with these wonderful these marshmallows. Marshmallows. So I turned it up to high. Should I turn it down low or we're gonna no, let it get that's kind of high? fine, because it will get to simmer. Let me get something so to... So what I actually did is, is we used milk instead of cream. Um, just because we didn't have uh, heavy cream lying around, so um, we just decided to use milk. Also, remember over at the Ganachery, I got this delicious toffee, which I've come to find out, um, I thought Kristen, because it was um, dark chocolate, that she would love it. Kristen's not a fan of toffee, so there we go. That's oh. okay. You know who is? This guy. Mmm. So good. Love it. So. I but can the tell dark you, chocolate was delicious. Yeah, I can tell you that the recommendation um, from the employee at the Ganachery, the chocolatier, that this is the best thing they have, I agree, it's delicious. <laughs> Maybe someday Kristen will agree. This is so cool. I, I can't get over how cool this is. I wish I would get the camera to focus on it. Come on, focus on Olaf, focus on Olaf. It will not focus on Olaf. <laughs> hmm. Everything but Olaf. There you go. There's Olaf right there in macro. He looks great. Okay, so we have to wait for the milk to simmer. That's right, it should only take a second because there's mm -hmm. not much milk in there. There's not much milk in there. So we'll stir it. Yeah, if I would have been a little more prepared, we probably should have stopped at the store to get a little bit of heavy cream because it's gonna. this is gonna boil real fast. Yeah, okay, um, well, should we grab a tongs? And it's starting already if we wanna. Mm -hmm. um, gingerly, very gingerly, set Mr. Olaf. Of course the tongs are, um, <laughs> they're not clean. <laughs> Wait, I thought we had a second pair of tongs laying around. We don't, but that's gonna boil. Okay, well we wanna turn it down just okay. a little bit probably, huh? Yeah. There we go, okay. Here, I'll clean these, cause. Very smart, clearly we were prepared. Hey, look at this amazing, um, Disney Christmas tree <laughs> that we got from Audrey. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. Uh, I figured it was the perfect holiday touch to make our hot cocoa, which it is um, 77 degrees outside for hot cocoa. You know, <laughs> there, is there ever a bad time for hot chocolate? No, there's never a bad time for no. hot chocolate. Okay, are you ready? I'm ready, so okay. I put it on low because I didn't want it to, um, boil while I turned around for a second. All right, do you want to put Olaf in for his bath? Well, not yet, because it's not, it's not simmering. Okay, so it needs to simmer. Mm-hmm, yeah. Otherwise, we've spoiled the whole ordeal here. It needs to be able to be hot enough that he just kind of melts down. So, do you think it's sad that you're actually melting Olaf so that we can have delicious hot chocolate? That is kind of sad sad situation there. So like we said, so Olaf was about $17. So um, $17 for two, kind cup, of a lot. two cups of hot cocoa. But you know what? This is all really about the experience though, isn't it? I hope so. <laughs> I mean, even Starbucks hot chocolate is not that expensive. That's true. Yeah. I have special hot chocolate mugs for us here. Ready? Okay. Excellent. Now what I was thinking is, is on a hot day at the springs, you're going to want to be careful if you carry Olaf around with you. That is a good point. You're not if you want are him to here melt. at Disney, mm -hmm. um, mind you, it is December, but it can be very hot here like it is today. And especially when the sun's out, sometimes it's not even about how hot it is, but if the sun's out, it can melt very easily. Yes. Uh, so that is something, or leave it in your car. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Don't leave him in your car because no. he's, He's gonna melt super, super easily in, yeah. in your car. Yeah, we made sure not to. Yeah. Leave. That is so cool though, isn't it? The Florida sun can do a number here on little Olaf and then <laughs> you would be quite disappointed when you get home. Yeah. Um, or, you know what? Anybody who's staying in a local vacation home or a local DVC You've got a probably fridge. has the opportunity because they will have 
Okay, so this is... Ready? Definitely ready. Okay, you wanna lower, lower him into his bath. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Magic is happening. I hope this works. Goodbye, Olaf. This is difficult. Not goodbye, it's just, we'll see you soon in a different form. Okay. He is starting to melt for sure. Oh, he is melting. Here, we'll turn, we'll turn the heat back on a little bit. Oh no, he's falling over. And the directions were, we need to whisk him once he starts to fall in here. Oh! Oh no! He melted quickly. Well, he's still got a lot. He's got a pretty thick chocolate outer shell. Once he starts to melt, whisk together until the chocolate is fully incorporated. All right, let's whisk. Whisk away. Well, we can't whisk quite yet, because see, he's still pretty intact. Look. <gasps> That's the cocoa inside. Yeah. Wow. So instead of whisking, I'm giving it just a quick second. So for everybody thinking it's just solid chocolate, it's not. It has co it's a cocoa bomb, so it has cocoa on the inside. Oh yeah, this is definitely melting now super fast. There. Wow, that looks delicious. Mm. And you know what I have to say, if sometimes um, you find people who aren't a fan of cocoa because it's pretty thick or sugary, if you had, um, you could probably do like a couple of kids. So if you wanted this for your kids, that's like why I use your... milk instead of heavy cream. It makes it a little less rich, right? Well, the heavy cream is the good stuff. I know. The heavy cream is really what makes it good. We're gonna taste a big difference. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm sure you're right. So, but I was saying there is enough here that if you added um, a little bit of heavy cream on top of this, um, since we did use all milk, you have enough here to have a couple of small Oh, that's cups. for, yeah, for four people, that's enough, right? Um, you know, unless you want a really large cup of cocoa. So this is definitely ready to go. All right, let's pour it out. Let me put this off to the side so we don't mm -hmm. get everything all dirty. I've got our cups all ready here. Okay, well, let me move some of this. And key to the process, marshmallow. That's right. But. You can just open these up. These are freshly made marshmallows they too. They are fresh. They, those are so not dehydrated marshmallows. just you know, they did not just get these from a typical store. They make these in-house at the ganachery. Um, so they actually taste delicious. Okay. Don't burn yourself. I know. I will not. Oh, wow. However, this is so super hot, you could easily burn yourself for sure. So make sure little hands are out of the way. Mm. Oh yeah. All right, we need to we'll top it with off. those marshmallows. Here. So we'll put a marshmallow here and here and we'll save the rest. We'll give some to the kids when yeah, we're done. That's right. And so this is super blazing hot. Oh boy. All right, let's um let's flip this around here. <laughs> All right, are you ready to try some here? Um, that might burn my mouth. <laughs> okay. Wow. Um, I did try a little bit. Whoa. Um, that is good. <laughs> All right? Yeah, all we did wow. was use um, just plain milk. But if you use heavy cream, it mm. would just make it that much better, but the wow. chocolate and the cocoa mix that they have at the ganachery is phenomenal. I can't believe this that that's really without heavy This is a really great treat. Yeah, that is delicious. It's got a really great chocolate flavor. It does. Um, like as in fresh chocolate. This is not- You know, you can taste a difference when you get kind of Swiss Miss versus a oh, homemade wow. hot chocolate with actual chocolate in it. I was just gonna say, this is not your Swiss Miss. No. This is so much better than that. So I could see at 
If you were looking for something for maybe Christmas Eve night, a special oh, occasion. wow. Decorating the, with the kids. This would be a perfect surprise for Christmas Eve night to make with the kids before bed or, you know, yes. as you're reading your Christmas stories before bed. Oh my gosh, what? And they do give you enough marsh, what do they give you? Six marshmallows. So you know what? You yeah. could make six small glasses of cocoa with this. Yeah. And if you watered it down with mm -hmm. a little bit extra milk, because it is very rich, even, even without definitely the heavy cream. Definitely add the heavy cream. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I would say definitely add the heavy cream but if you're like us and you got home and you said oops I forgot to go pick some up then using just the milk still it tastes amazing it really amazing does. yeah it was the heavy cream would just make it a bit thicker yeah um, so mm -hmm. I I do recommend and if I were to do this again I probably would purchase this and I think when we give some to the kids in a little bit they're gonna agree yeah, for sure. I think this is a do again. This is a definite must. If you're able yeah. to get this home on the plane, you have to be very careful because mm -hmm. it could melt. Or just here, if you're in, mm -hmm. in around here vacationing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, for sure. Do you want to do a cheers here for uh, okay. for, for the holidays? Happy holidays, everybody. And uh, definitely go get yourself yeah. an Olaf. You won't be disappointed, right? That's right. Cheers. cheers. Happy holidays. Mm. Wow.